Hi, I'm Stacy from SecureAuth, and in this video, I'm going to show you how easy it is to enable and configure SecureAuth's numerous multi-factor authentication methods to use in your organization. In the SecureAuth Identity Platform web admin, navigate to multi-factor methods to enable and configure your global multi-factor authentication methods to use in your organization. You will see here the ones that are enabled and disabled out of the box. If you want to enable any of them, simply click the edit icon here and switch it from off to on and configure any of the settings present in the screen. We group various methods in our authentication apps, for example, and out of the box we have the time-based passcode automatically enabled. To enable the others, you will also click the pencil icon here and simply check them and set any of the configurations required. The authentication apps also includes our new MFA method, the biometric identification, where users can use their fingerprint or facial recognition to accept a login request and log into the application. Click Save. And now you'll see that on authentication apps, you now have the login notification and biometric identification enabled. These can be updated and changed at any time, and they are applied to the policies in which you select which MFA methods to use to create a more flexible workflow. Thanks for joining us today. To learn more, visit www.secureauth.com.